Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So recently, Microsoft rolled out their August optional bug fix updates for Windows 10 and Windows 11. And for Windows 11 version 22H2, the update was KB5029351. And for Windows 10, the update was KB5029331. And I posted on both those updates, and I'll leave both uh, videos down below in the description. Now, unfortunately, once again, after installing these August optional bug fix updates, uh, there are issues. And Microsoft has received reports of an issue, which is now an official known issue over on their health dashboard page. They have received reports of an issue in which users are receiving an unsupported processor error message, even though they are running supported processors um, for those operating systems on a blue screen. So that's a stop error, a blue screen of death after installing updates released on August the 22nd, as mentioned, which is KB5029351 and KB5029331. And that's after restarting your device to obviously apply those updates. Now, um, they also do mention, though, that um, the updates might automatically uninstall to allow Windows to start up as expected. So what's happening here is that after this, um, you restart your device, you get a blue screen, a stop error, and then it gives you the message unsupported processor, although your uh, processor is supported. And then what Windows might do, though, is it might automatically uninstall that update so your device can obviously restart. Because if you can't restart, then you obviously can't get into your device without repairing your, your system and so on. Now, Microsoft does say that if you are experiencing these issues, please use the Feedback Hub to file a report following uh, the below steps. Now, I'll leave the actual known issue down below where you can follow all the steps on how and how you must fill in the Feedback Hub. And if you don't know where the Feedback Hub is, you can just do a search uh, for Feedback Hub on your system. I've long since uninstalled the Feedback Hub, but just do a search for Feedback Hub and then you can uh, follow the steps um, from that known issues page, which I'll leave down below if you would like to obviously um, file a report if you are affected by that issue and ex are experiencing those issues. Now, Microsoft uh, doesn't really seem to know at this stage what is causing the issues. But there are reports that the issues are mainly affecting MSR boards, motherboards. So it's mainly affecting MSR motherboards, irrespective if you have an Intel or AMD CPU. So um, mainly affecting MSR motherboards with that error message uh, processor, sorry, unsupported processor. Now, Microsoft does say the next steps um, are that they are investigating to determine if this is an issue caused by Microsoft. So obviously, yeah, Microsoft trying obviously not to put the, the ball in their court. But nonetheless, they say they will provide an update when more information is available. So we hope for that is sooner than later. And obviously, um, when I do get that info, um, I'll post and let you guys know if you are affected by this unsupported processor message with the blue screen of death. And the affected platforms, as mentioned, are Windows 11 version 22H2, Windows 10 version 22H2, and Windows 11 version 21H2. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.